welcome to class today. Today we are continuing with the topic fabrics. And all of that we want to look at manufacture, identification and uses of fabrics. How we will be able to manufacture different fabrics. How to identify and the uses of different fabrics. By the end of the lesson, you should be able to identify the steps in the manufacture of different fabrics. Also, you have to discuss simple fabric finishes, give the uses of each of the fabric. Manufacturing process of cutting fibers. Remember, we have different types of fibers. We have natural fibers and we have synthetic or man-made fiber. Cutting is under natural fiber. And these are the, the steps involved in the manufacturing process of cotton. Number one, we have ginning, we have baling, cleaning, carding, drawing, spinning, dyeing, and weaving. We have other manufacturing process for other fibers. Also, we have to look at fabric finishes. What we refer to as fabric finishes. Fabric finishes simply means the treatment or the processes applied to fibers or fabric after manufacturing to change its appearance, to change its and or performance of the clothes. That is what we refer to as fabric finishes. Let's look at types of fabric finishes. We have multiple. This prevents the moth from attacking the clothes. We have water repellent finishes, that is the clothes will not absorb water. Then we have wrinkle resistant finishes. Wrinkle resistant finishes will make the cloth resist wrinkling. Then we have stain resistant finishes. We have moisture finish in which naturally gives the cloth a shiny appearance. We have antibacterial finish and we have anti shrinkage treatment. All right. In conclusion, textile has several uses. The most common is for clothing. That is the what we know. Mostly, when we talk of textile, what we put on. In the household, textile are using carpeting, furnishing, window shades, towel, table cover, bed sheet, anchor sheet, cleaning devices, and the likes. In the workplace, they are used in the industrial and scientific process, such as featuring. Join me in the classroom for further explanation on this. Thank you.